Well guys, I think I fixed the starter. I sprayed some graphite lube on the Bendix gear and my hands can move it freely. So let's see what happens. So what I actually just did was I um, I actually uh, hooked up a battery cable to the starter and I hooked up the solenoid on the starter to the real key switch here. So I'm going to hook up my jumper box and see if I can start it. We'll see what happens. Well, the starter's working right. I'm going to give it a shot of ether. It hasn't run for a long, long time. Oh crap, it's empty. Not cool. Oh, I'll give it some carb cleaner. That, that was edible. Which I say flammable. Where do I got the throttle set here? I think I got the throttle linkage all messed up. It wants to be wide open and I got an idle. So let me see if I can fix that. All right, let's see what happens. Piece of junk battery. Well, the starter's working right, but it's just got no power. Why is that? Got a lot of compression out of this motor here. A real lot. junk it just doesn't have the balls to turn it over I'm gonna take the spark plugs out try it with no plugs in this starter I had on my other uh, Onan and I kind of had the same problem with that one where it just didn't have the balls to turn the thing over so I ended up putting a different starter on it and it worked fine see if it can turn it over with no plugs Yeah, the stupid Bendix is sticking up. Piece of junk. That Bendix is hung. I think this this starter is a little tired. All right, I just poured a little bit of gas in the carb. Let's see what happens this time. Nothing.
Yeah, thing's dead. I need a new starter. That simple. Well, I'm going to upgrade the starter on the Onan here to a new style Onan starter. And this just came in the mail yesterday. Let's see what we got here. I've not opened it yet. Quite the packaging job. Got the starter in here. All wrapped in foam. And here we go. Yeah, now we're talking. Look at this bad boy. This thing's awesome. Hell yeah. That thing is mint. Look at that thing. I'm liking it. So, in order to use this starter, we have to put a different bracket onto the tractor. And uh, yeah, it's amazing how light this is. The other starter weighs like 30 pounds. Here's the uh, bracket here. I'm putting some paint on it. This is a used one that I'm cleaning up. But, uh, so we'll put that onto the machine. And uh, in order to put it on, we got to pull the flywheel off and then we got to take off the old starter and then uh, we'll mount that bracket and starter and put it back together so i can pull the flywheel off and uh get working all right we've got our new uh bracket here and uh this is my new starter which if you compare to the old one is much smaller and much lighter so we'll see what happens it just goes on with two screws up here i already chipped my new paint by the way but uh i painted it yellow because the tractor is supposed to be yellow figure if someday i'm going to repaint it yellow i won't have to do that part so we'll see what happens all right let's see if it starts Put some ether in the plugs here for a minute. 